Good morning, everybody. Uh, sorry, good, <laughs> good evening, everybody. Um, how are you? Good evening, teacher. Sorry, good evening. Sorry, guys, I was my computer was stuck and I couldn't get into the into the uh, the application. Sorry. All right. Um, how are you guys? How's everybody? Pretty good. Yes, pretty good. Not too bad. Yes, teacher. Very good. Yeah. Okay. Good. 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 I'm glad to hear that. All right. Um. So, um. Do you? How was you? Um. Do you guys um are it's better said? Are you guys having any? Uh, problems with the platform? Yes, in the first, uh, I can't make song exercise. Mm -hmm. but I don't remember the number. I see it now. Okay. Yeah, if you can tell me what the number is, I'll be able to help you a little bit better. Um, well, yeah, the, the section and, and the number, and then I can help you a little bit better. Is um only you are having problems or is someone else having any problems that maybe I can help with? No, nobody else is having no. problems. No. Okay. All right, wonderful. Okay, so if no one's having, if no one else so goes, uh, then teacher is here. Uh, I see that is in the unit one uh, that I have a problem. Mm. Okay. Um, number one point three. Um, a specific number three. I try some times, but uh, all the time is incorrect. 1.3, you said? Yes. Okay. And, um, uh -huh. and uh, number three of this section. Okay. Um, Mirna, is that the same one we were talking about? Sorry? <laughs> Remember last time I helped with, with one of the exercises? Yes, you, yes, I asked him, but it's the same question that Carlos uh, says uh, at the beginning of the class, because we have to write this, the, 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 the old sentences, not not just the verb. I I but, I was the the, the verb, but uh, if you write all sentences, the platform for uh, accept the answer. Okay. Accept the answer. Yeah. Yeah, I I think that's the same one, Ana Lorena. No, teacher, because no? I have probably only one uh, exercise in this. Okay, only, so only the number three. Okay, so so you said it's one point what? Yes, one point, and in this section, the number three. One point what? One point three? Yes. Okay. One point three, number three. Yes. Okay, I I think that in this question 
is missing one word, uh, someone, I think, because I check in the in oh. the in the book on the I check in the the, the material that we have and mm -hmm. the is missing someone, I think so, but would you share the yes. answer? Yes, you're absolutely right. You need, you need to say that it's that it's a it's a person, someone. Mm -hmm. Yeah, right. this is the problem that having in that uh, specific in that uh, uh, sentences because I check in the in the class in we we review the 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 notebook that, that that we saw in the class and the and the it's missing the manual yes and missing the someone okay. just the the word mm -hmm. yeah so so it should be it should say something like um an autocratic manager is someone blah 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 blah, blah. okay thanks mm -hmm. okay all right um so is that the only problem that we're having? Or do you guys have any more problems? So, so far, so good? Thanks, Supriya. Okay. Yeah? No, 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 no questions then. All right, in that case, guys, um, let's uh, take attendance. Okay. Um, just give me a moment. My document opens, like I said, on my computer is very, very slow today. Ah. My computer is like, it's almost time. It's almost the end of the week. I don't want to work anymore. Almost there. Okay, got it. Um, Ana Lorena Lovato, Orellana. Yes, present it. Wonderful. Um, Carlos Alberto Dominguez Martinez. Carlos Alberto Dominguez Martinez. Carlos Ernesto Hernández Cepeda. Present. Thank you. Um, remember, guys, cameras on. I see like only half of the class, so I don't know what happened to the other class, the other classmates. Um, Carlos Mauricio Menjiver Caballero. Present. Wonderful. Edwin Antonio Quinteros Omaña. Present. Excellent. Emerson Ulises Monroy Calix. Present. Thank you. Eulise Torres Torres. Present. Thank you. Iliana Rebeca Carpio Calderón. Iliana Rebeca Carpio Calderón. Jorge Antonio Sanchez Quiñones. Present. Thank you. Jose Bernardo Lopez Montes. Present, Miss. Excellent. Thank you. Um, Jose Carlos Argueta Romero. Present. Thank you. Jose Salvador Bernal Quintanilla. Teacher. 
Thank you. Um, Josman Atilio Serrano. Josman Atilio Serrano. Did, no sé si vi, vi mal que le había puesto mensaje, no. Sí, creo que sí. Okay. Juan Carlos Herrera Delgado. Gracias, Thank you. Um, Kevin Alfredo Lucero Menéndez. Kevin Alfredo Lucero Menéndez. Mauricio Antonio Velázquez. Thank you. Mauricio, I'm sorry, uh, no. Mayra Cecilia Peña de Paricio. Mayra Cecilia. Nelson Alberto Peraza Mejía. Present. Thank you. Nelson Alberto Peraza Mejía. Present. Thank you. Osman Enrique Hernández. Present teacher. Thank you. Rafael Alexander Serra Díaz. Rafael Alexander Serna Díaz. Ricardo Ernesto Pérez Acosta. Present teacher. Thank you. Sandra Abigail Boniacano. Present. Thank you. Eh, Sandra va a estar con nosotros en la clase. Sandra. Hola Sandra. Es que pregunto por qué, porque cuando vamos a los grupos y todo, usted nunca participa y quiero asegurarme que sí usted está en la clase o va a estar en esa clase. Así que dejamos ahí grabado que, que sí. Usted está en la clase. Ok, bueno. Sandra, necesitamos ahí confirmación de que realmente usted está tomando la clase. De lo contrario es... No podemos hacer mucho. Ok. Um, Sigfrido Ernesto Gómez Guinea. Thank you. Wendy Maricela Ramírez Guevara. Present teacher, good evening. Good evening. Mirna Elizabeth de Alvarenga Rivas. Present. Thank you. Irma Evelyn Rodríguez Torres. Present. Thank you. And uh, Amanda Leonela Zamora Miranda. Present teacher. Okay, Present. wonderful. Thank you. Okay. All right, guys. So um, just, just a reminder that we need you guys not just to answer for the attendance, but also actually be participating in class. That is actually part of the requirement to be in the class and to pass because if you're not participating, if you're not, um, if you're not actually practicing the language, you're not gonna learn the language. It's impossible. 
no se puede aprender un idioma sin practicarlo. O sea, o cualquier otra cosa, no solo el idioma, cualquier otra cosa. Entonces, eh, por eso necesitamos su participación activa. A veces yo entiendo que algunos de ustedes eh, tienen situaciones um, atípicas. En el, por ejemplo, veo que algunos están de camino a casa y todo, y, y, y eso lo entiendo. Eh, pero sí, en, como general, ¿verdad? Tratemos siempre de, de participar porque de eso se trata. Aprender un idioma es de practicar. Um, ¿verdad? No, no lo vamos a aprender solo de escuchar a otros. Tenemos que también nosotros eh, practicarlo. Así es que los invito a que todos eh, puedan participar en la clase. Eh, no, tengan, no tengan miedo de que, ah, que, que van a decir de mí, que, que se van a burlar. No, o sea, aquí estamos todos aprendiendo toditos, y me incluyo, me incluyo, todos aquí aprendemos, um, todos estamos mejorando, todos eh, aprendemos algo todos los días, así de que, um, sí, aquí estamos para, para ayudarnos, para aprender, así de que no, no tengan pena hacer preguntas, eh, algo no entendimos, pregunten, Uh, no se queden con la duda porque si no eh, eso les, les afecta al final para quedarse con esa duda al final hace que las lagunas se hagan más grandes entonces eh, no, o sea, yo quiero que ustedes tengan éxito quiero que ustedes puedan aprender quiero que ustedes puedan ser bilingües um, pero la única forma es eh, despejando esas dudas, ¿verdad? Y, y pudiendo uh, mejorar. De hecho, los, los um, errores no son malos. Todo lo contrario, son buenos. Porque si tenemos errores, significa de que estamos haciendo el intento. Y si aprendemos de ese error, podemos llegar muy, muy lejos. Así de que no tengan miedo en, en cometer errores, que eso es de humanos, ¿ok? Ok, bueno, um, all right, so yesterday we were, um, we were making sentences with the first conditional, talking about four different situations, and I told you guys that um, I needed you to, everybody in the group, to have um, a, what's it called? To have a copy of all of the sentences because we were going to be making new groups and you were going to be sharing. And that's what we're gonna do right now. We're gonna be sharing your sentences with everybody, okay? Um, so I'm going to be sending you to breakout rooms and you're going to be sharing your um, your ideas with the group, okay? If there is anybody, because I, I, I don't remember, like I don't have the groups from yesterday. So if there is anybody that ends up being with people from your same group, please let me know, okay? So you can press the, the help button and I'll come over and I'll change you so that you're not with the same people, okay? Because the idea is for you to share new information, right? Not to have like the same, the same people, right? The idea is for you to share um, ideas and get new sentences, okay? Do we understand? Is that pretty yes, clear? Teacher. Yes, teacher. <clears throat> okay, all right, so... I'm going to give you about, um, I think about 15 minutes because um, everybody in the group is going to share your idea. So you're going to discuss. It's not just about boom, 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 boom. These are the answers. I want you to actually discuss it. Like say, ah, oh, you know, like comment on your partner's ideas. Like, oh, that's, that's a good idea. I never had thought about that. Or, um, you know, 
you know, I have you ever thought about this, you know, things like that. Just give comment, give feedback to your classmates. Okay. Are we ready? Everybody has the sentences. Do we understand what we're doing? Yes, yes teacher. Perfect. All right, let's go for it then. Edwin Antonio Quintero, so Lises, are you having trouble connecting? Edwin, are you having trouble connecting? In 21 page, I think so, the unit two. And you have four situations and the four situations, they have to write three sentences about the situation. Okay, okay. Mm -hmm. Mauricio, do you, have the, do you have the sentence? If you want, we can, yeah. we can yeah. start. Nice. Uh, yesterday uh, I, I I was working in a, a task work task work uh, in my job but uh, I remember uh, we ha we was working in a screen uh, let, let me let me I'm going to share I'm going okay. to share uh, see, let me see. Ah, page twenty one. Yes, uh, the sentence of the uh, the first. Each, yes. each case. Yes, yesterday we, we was a uh, uh, work uh, we was working in in this example in this uh, situation. Okay. I remember that. I remember uh, for example we had uh, we had to read the all sentence uh, all situation is about uh, a problem in your job in the, uh, the job for in example your job yes yes mm -hmm. for I, example uh, the number one is my co-worker team is always interrupting me when i explain how uh, to carry on procedures wait, wait. Wait a minute, wait a minute, Carlos. Teacher, uh, I'm sorry. Uh, I know you always ask, ask us uh, if, if we understand the exercise. Mm -hmm. Yes, I know. Uh, but uh, in this case, we had to practice again this exercise. Uh, no. You wrote sentences with your group right hey, my, my yeah. problem I, I don't have the, the cell phone <laughs> uh, uh, I what, what do you mean use... what do you mean to have a cell phone what I, I don't understand what's the problem yeah I, I I hear you you send us a sentence in the no. whatsapp group no 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 no, no. no. Oh, yesterday okay. Yesterday, 
you made uh, sentences with your group. Yes. Yes? Yeah, yes. Okay. Yes. So you are going uh, to share uh, those understand. sentences with 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 your new group. Okay, uh, uh, right now okay, I, so I you're sh it's it's yes. you're, you're sharing information basically. Yes, yes, okay. for example, teacher, uh, I don't know if you can see my What? Yesterday, yesterday, uh, uh, my coworker and I, uh, and I, uh, worked, uh, in this sentence. Uh, are suggest, suggest about the exercise? Okay. okay. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I, I so, understand. Yeah. So, so yesterday, I, I gave you a chance as a group to come yes. up with ideas. So. Okay, yesterday. Yeah. So, um, okay. So Ricardo, yeah. So Ricardo, for example, is sharing, right? Um, but if if you can, Ricardo, you can also like say it verbally, so that you can all discuss it together, if it's possible. Yes, each other. The exercise, uh, uh, are this. Uh, I'm 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 a little I'm a little uh, busy with my work right now, so I was going uh. to send you only the the the. the the suggestion we write with Osman and sorry. <laughs> okay, okay. All right, no problem. So so Ricardo there is sharing in the group the sentences that they talked about yesterday. So then you can what you can do is is this, first you can discuss Ricardo's ideas and then you can share yours. Sound sound good? Mm. Ricardo? Can you explain us? So, so I think I think he said that he's a bit busy right now at work, so he's just writing them down. Do you see? Do you see in the chat that he's written? Osman, Carlos, yeah. do you see? Is he in the chat? He's he's writing the sentences. In in the chat in in this moment. Yeah, in 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 the Zoom chat. Okay, okay. In the group. Yeah. Yes. In this yeah. moment, uh, I am checking. Okay. Ah, yes, teacher. Okay, yes. so uh, he shared. Uh, uh -huh. I, I design exercise. Uh, I, I I get I have have this. Okay, so I I need you to to continue. Um. So he is writing them down so you can discuss those ideas. Okay. 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 Yeah. Yes. Yes. Okay. All right. I, perfect. I, I right. think I understand. <laughs> Great. Uh, I, okay. We are you are try teacher. Okay. Cool. Yes, well. All right. Perfect. Perfect. Okay. Um. So, Carlos and Elisa too. You can also participate. Okay. Este Carlos eh, Hernandez. Yeah. Yes. Eh, uh, I, I don't know if you can see my. No. Oh. You you can discuss the sentence of of Carlos Mauricio Carlos Mauricio mm -hmm. about the, the exercise number four. Yes, yes. Go ahead. Oh, oh, you send you sent it. The, the sentence or sentence, the right? No, Carlos. Mm -hmm. Yes, all central here. The, the, the agua, if you feel scared no. to sound arrogant, uh, this sentence is associated with what? Uh, if you feel scared okay. to sound arrogant, you can try practicing with someone else first. That is the first example. Mm -hmm. Ah, okay. Mm -hmm. My co-workers 
team is always interrupting me when I explain how to carry on produce on procedures to carry I don't know what is carry how to carry on procedures correctly I am scared to some scare as to sound arrogant if I let him know okay and you you said Carlos if you feel scared to sound arrogant you can try practicing with someone else first mm -hmm. what or or who can be this somewhere else someone whatever uh -huh. maybe another employee your friend maybe your friend. with a friend right no. because you you yeah. feel some mm -hmm. uh, the idea is if you have confidence. to say something and, and you are and you are not um sure about uh if you can sound sound arrogant so you can try to 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 say another person and the other person if your friend he told you he will tell you hey, no, yes you, you sound arrogant <laughs> exactly you don't have to use that word or you don't have to use oh, okay. that sound maybe maybe she she can improve how how the words that she Mm -hmm. she can use you are go right. to a, how to arrive the problem go to a right mm -hmm. yes mm, well another uh, do you have another sentence of the exercise no those 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 just those answers those answers yeah. but you told that you complete completed all the exercise no no we share oh. the fourth exercise oh. in my last team so oh. I, uh, this is uh, uh, this is my part so i try to do another one with the last one yeah okay mm -hmm, mm -hmm. but now we can try to complete it and the other examples with other sentences Make yes you know? we we can do the well, well i i'm going to do a sentence of the second exercise right now and we can discuss um mm -hmm, mm -hmm. La later yeah, yes. Okay. Hey, Jose Salvador, I don't, I don't know if you if you have a sentence of the exercise. Mm, no. Okay. I don't understand this exercise. Um, we need to do a sentence using the first conditional. First conditional, exactly. That it, is when you use first. if. Um, mm -hmm. sentence if and second okay. sentence. Um, Jose Salvador, were you here yesterday? No, teacher. Oh, okay. I, I can. Okay, no problem. All right. Um, yeah. So, do you remember first conditionals? We started talking about that two days ago. At the end of the class, mm, we yes. saw the first conditional. So, th yesterday we were. I don't know. Did I send it to the group? Did I send the picture? Yeah, I did. Okay, so in the in the WhatsApp group, I sent the last picture that I sent is the situations that we were discussing yesterday. And we had these situations and your idea was to make con uh, first sentences with the using the first conditional to talk about what you would do. So for example, and I, and I gave an example there. Um, the, the first one says, my, com my coworker Tim is always interrupted, interrupted me when I explain how to carry me when, sorry, how to carry on procedures correctly, but I'm scared to sound arrogant if I let him know. And I wrote, in in the at the bottom there if you let him know that it bothers you when you when he interrupts you be respectful do you see that mm. it's in it's in the group can you I repeat said, please 
It's in the group. Do you see? I, I sent a, a picture to the group yesterday. To the WhatsApp. Yes, but in the WhatsApp group, there is the <laughs> sentence that I wrote. Mm -hmm. So below the, the the situation, I wrote a sentence as an example. If you let him know that it bothers you when he interrupts you, be respectful. Okay. So okay. The, so you're just sharing. So right now the idea was to share what you talked about in your groups. Okay. But because you were not here yesterday, you can just share your own ideas. Okay. Does that make sense? Yes. Yeah. Okay. All right. Carry on. Pretend I'm not here. Uh, Carlos and Kevin, uh, I don't understand which uh, example do you work in this moment? Uh, uh, for which example uh, do you make um, ex in sentences? Um, in my case, I work just in the number four. In the okay. last one, I, I'm going um, to, but do you have the, the yes, page? The, yeah. Yes. Okay. But uh, I don't understand what which uh, example do you uh, analyze and work in this moment. And we analyze the last one, the number four. Okay. He's talking about uh, if uh, she make a mistake in the report, so make a note into the other department and they fail with the. In, in base investment, I don't, I yes. don't remember the word. Um, just setting uh, you go, guys. Okay, so I yes. just wanted to let you know the the time is up, but yes. because I see that you are not completely finished, I'll give you about five more minutes. Okay, so just letting you know so you can stay in your groups. Okay. 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 Thank you, teacher. You're welcome. So I I a different sanction. Uh. Based in the report. work call, yes. Just letting you know, guys, that um the time is over, but because I'm, I see that the majority of the groups are not finished, I'll give you a little bit more time, okay? So just so that you know that you can stay in your groups, okay? Okay, teacher. For example, in my company, if you don't use for work the safety equipment, uh, do you have a, a... If you find, she finds because he's a third person, finds. Oh, I try. Okay, let me try. Oh, All nice, right. thank you. That's it. Guys, I just wanted to let you know that um, the time is up but because I'm seeing that many groups are still working. I'm giving you a little bit more time, okay? So just, you can stay in your groups and continue discussing, okay? Thank you. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Hey. Okay, y el siguiente... <laughs> Number four, right? Teacher, we finished the, the the activity. Oh, you really finished? Yeah, oh. so we were talking about the platform at the moment. Oh, okay, okay, wonderful. Okay, yes, so everybody finished. everybody shared the yes. sentences and you discussed them, yeah? Yes. Okay, okay perfect, perfect. Uh, do you have any questions about the platform? And I have one question, but my friend Juan Carlos helped me. Oh, okay. I Perfect. was missing one letter S for a verb in the third person. Oh, okay, okay. Good, good. Okay. All right. Um, I'm going to go and just check out the other groups. 
but nice. yeah, we'll we'll be back in the main in the main room in a moment. Okay. 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 Hello, guys. How are Hello, you doing? Teacher. Hello, teacher. Good, teacher. I share some examples with Wendy. Okay. All right. Very good. And Wendy, did you share your sentences? Yes. Yes, teacher. Okay. All right. Um, Osman, you're still on, on your way home? Osman is not here. He's, on, he's a listener. Yeah, I know. I, he, wrote, he wrote in the chat, but... I'm just yes. wondering if he's if he's still on his way home. Okay, I guess he is. Okay. Um all right. Do you so you don't need more time? Yes, teacher, please. You need more time or you don't need more time? Uh we need more time, oh, okay. please. All right, I'll give you a little bit more time then. You have about two or three more minutes, okay? Okay. Thank yes, you. Mm -hmm. You're welcome. Wendy, I send uh, another example uh, for the number two. Yes. When I, when I worry this mm -hmm. uh, conditional taper tree, it's more difficult. When you use modal, you say. Yeah. Yeah, because you have to use two, two verbs. <laughs> yeah, because the modal plus infinitive. Yeah. Is, or or the no, it's not to is for example. The infinitive verb. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Infinitive verb. But I think that is okay. I mean, in my okay. case, I prefer to use willow. <laughs> because it's easy. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> All right. Are you, guys, me. are you guys finished or do you need more time? Uh, for me, I... Uh, I think. Yes, we talk, yes. teacher. We talk about the the situation, and we and we say the the sentences that we wrote yesterday, and we try to understand and try to 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 check that if we have a mistake or something like that. But <laughs> okay, okay. Um, all right, good. Um, so so you are are finished, you're ready. No questions? Uh, I see. In modal. I I have a in I modal, have a yeah. Where, in yeah. modal we have some some question oh. because we are not um we have no sentences in modal. We we not wrote, wrote the sentences in modal. Just use if and will. <laughs> uh -huh. yeah. You always have to use will. Sorry, uh, if. Um, but... and if yeah yeah. But the 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 others uh, the others way that you have to that you can uh -huh. uh, is the use if plus present simple and plus uh, modal plus infinitive uh -huh. or uh -huh. Or may, or you can use uh, the the imperative. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. So instead of using will, you could just simply say words like might. Right. Oh. So, um. So showing that it's a possibility and not for sure, because when you use will, it's more like I'm sure about it. You know, this is this is exactly what will happen. But if you use might, it's like uh, it's like a possibility, 50, 50 percent of a chance. For example, for example, this: if you let him know that you feel anxious, 
He may change the way of supervising. No. Can, can you repeat that, Irma? If you let him know that you feel anxious, he may change the way of supervising you. Yeah, exactly. Mm. Oh. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, so it's not it's not a big science, right? Just basically re um, uh, replacing will with with any model that makes sense. Oh, okay. The the when you use my yeah, I, I my. yeah. So might me could yeah. When you oh okay okay okay. okay. Yeah. So Fantasy. actually, may may might and could all indicate a possibility. Okay, so it's like don't fifty percent. Okay. Um, don't use can. Yeah. Don't use can. Uh, can. no, 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 no. Can no. No. Oh, okay. 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 Um. What a make. My... Oh, wait a sec. Hold on. Wait. Just give me a second. Yeah, actually, you could. You you could, but then it would not be possibility. It means that. It means that it's an ability. Uh -huh. Yeah. Yeah. Does that make mm -hmm. sense? So it's yeah. like, oh, so I for understand. example, um, I don't know. Um, if if I pass my exam, um, I can. I can continue to the next semester. Means that I have the ability uh -huh. of continuing to the next semester. Yeah, continue. Yeah. Yeah. Not 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 the possibility, but the the ability to do it. Okay. The the permission to do it. Okay, so it, it so you can yeah. use can use can, valga la redundancia. But um, but it's gonna change the meaning. It's not a possibility anymore but a, either a, a ability or a permission. But yes, you mm. can use many different models instead of will. Just okay. replace replace the use of will with one of those models, that's it. Will is more, is more uh, certero, es, es, es cierto, o sea, que, que lo hace uno. In, in yeah. my, may is a possibility, maybe yeah. yes or maybe no. Yeah, exactly, oh, yeah, okay. yeah. And, and no, also it's more concept. common. It's more common to use will, but okay. yeah. not impossible <laughs> to use the other ones. And yeah, it's more common. Use it's more. It's more easy use will because will will is future and it's a possibility. <laughs> yeah. But in reality, if you think about it, it's not. It's not really like that. It's easier because it's just simply replacing the word will with another word. That's it. So it's not like okay. the, the structure it doesn't change at all. It's just it's just that we're programmed to mm -hmm. automatically say will. But all you do, mm -hmm. all you have to do is take out will and in in the position of will, we put another uh, another um modal. That's it. Mm -hmm. No. That's it. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you. Okay. All right. Mm -hmm. Okay, great. So I'm going to bring you guys back to the main uh to the main session. Okay. So I'll see you over there. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. You're welcome.
Okay. All right, guys and girls, we have come back from our groups. Um, I think I've given you quite a lot of time to, to discuss. So I would like to hear these ideas. So I'm going to share the, the screen so that we can all see the, the situations. And I would like everybody to share with the class one of the best um, solutions or, yeah, let's say solutions to each situation. So let's, um, so you guys can see it, right? You, can, you guys can see my screen? Yes, yes. I can. Yes, I can see. Okay, yes, very I good. Can see. Um, all right, perfect. Um, so I would like you guys to give me feedback of what you have talked about. And then from all the groups, we're going to be choosing the best solution. Does that make sense? So you guys can share different ideas and then you're all gonna vote on the best solution from all the ideas. Does that make sense? Yes, no? Yes, teacher. Okay, so I'm gonna I'm gonna need your help because you're gonna have to share what you talked about. Okay, so the first one says, my coworker Tim is always interrupting me when I explain how to carry on procedures correctly, but I'm scared to sound arrogant if I let him know. What are some possible solutions there? Teacher, in in our group, uh, we had uh, one solution. Can can mm -hmm. we? Okay, all right. Please please share. For example, yes. For example, uh, I we we recommend. Uh, the girl uh, uh, speak with with him when with him in, in this case his team uh, okay. and she and she has uh, to say him I, I, I don't feel comfortable when you are interrupting interrupting me why why I explain the procedures <laughs> sorry I, I can procedures procedures mm -hmm. you Respect me explanation. Explanation. Um, 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 we we recommend she has to speak with a uh, team uh, that she don't feel fine when he interrupt interrupt her interrupt her when she is explained. Yes. Okay. Oh, only that. Okay. All right, thank you very much. Thank you, Osman. Okay, what about the others? Can you guys give me another idea? Mm -hmm. Other ideas? Yes, uh, the number one. Mm -hmm. Yes, please. Uh, in the group, we we have these sentences. If you feel scared to sound arrogant, you can explain him patently. You can explain? Explain him patently. Oh, okay. You, exp you can explain to, to him. Oh, always, uh, uh, him. you explain to somebody, yeah. You can explain oh. to him. Patiently. Patiently. Okay. Patiently. Patiently. Yeah. Thank you. But be careful with that one because um don't you don't want to confuse passion 
right? It's patient, patient. Patiently. Patiently, yeah. Exactly. Very good. Excellent, Carlos. Yeah. Uh, what is the rule when we need to use uh, explain to him? And what is the rule? I didn't, I don't remember. Um. Okay, so you explain something. Okay, so a thing, you explain a thing, like you explain a situation, you explain um, instructions, et cetera, et cetera. You explain something. But when it's someone, it's you explain to someone. Does that make sense? All, but always we need to put to? When it's somebody, yes. Um, Ex explain to me. Explain to her. So it, okay. you, when it's for a person, then you say to. Uh, and if we are using other bear? Like what? Um... Uh, maybe born quemando yo lo estaba quemando uh, burn I'm him born, born, but in this case we don't use we, we don't need to use two uh huh no yeah but that's scary I, <laughs> <laughs> no, well, no, 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 no. I about uh, bear, but, um, I'm just, I'm, I'm just, I'm just joking here. <laughs> I'm just teasing you. But, um, yeah, it, it's, it's each verb is going to be different, right? Okay. okay. Um. So, yeah, it's, 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 yeah, it, it's going to depend on each verb. But it, with the verb explain, you explain to somebody. And you explain something. Okay, okay. I got it. Yeah. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Okay. So yeah, it, each verb is going to be, yeah, it's going to be different. Okay. All right. Any other suggestions for this first um, situation? So we have two so far. Oh, I would like to hear. A third and a fourth, if possible. Mm -hmm. uh, in, in, in my group, we have another um, Sentence. If you feel scared to sound arrogant, you can try practicing with someone else first. Oh, okay. Yeah. Very good. Okay. Um, if you if you are afraid of sounding arrogant, you can try practicing with someone first, as you say. With uh, with someone else first. Okay. Yes. Yeah, okay, perfect. And then in that one, you used a, a, a modal, right? You can. Yes, you can. Mm -hmm. That's perfect. Yeah, exactly. Or you can even use an imperative. You could just say, try. Try practicing okay. on someone else. Yeah. Oh boy, you can. Yeah, I mean, there are many, many possible. There's nothing mm -hmm. wrong with what you said. There's mm -hmm. it's perfect, okay? I'm just letting you know that you can also use a, in another uh using the imperative another way mm -hmm. yeah exactly okay. okay very good very good carlos okay sure. uh, the means is is the same when when you use you can try and you try is the same meaning the meaning is same you can try and what was the other one you can try you can try and yes. you try without can. No, it's, it's not the same. It's an imperative form. Ah. Ah, yeah. oh, okay, okay. Um, if you just use try, try this, it's an imperative. Like it's it's okay. like a, okay. uh, yeah, it's a suggestion, let's say. 
Okay, try this. Okay. But if you say you can try, it, you're, um, it's also giving a suggestion, but it's um, basically saying that it's a, it's a possibility or it's 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 uh -huh. a... the, the other person has the possibility to if she wants she can do it or not. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Yeah. Okay, I got it. Thank yeah. you. Um all right, any other ideas? So we have three so far. Another idea. Okay, I will try teacher. Uh huh. Okay. And she would make a pause, the explanation, and try uh, tell him that he is being uh, a little annoyed, and tell tells him, uh, as well to please keep quiet when she is talking. Okay. Can you give me the 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 that idea in a first conditional sentence? The first condition. Mm -hmm. So if blah 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 blah. Oh. If if a uh, he if he have a uh, some idea, uh, he could uh, how do you say levantar la mano? Raise. He could raise the hand, and then uh, try. Uh, then um, sell the idea. Could be, I don't know. Okay. This is my okay. opinion. Okay, yeah, that's fine. Yeah, perfect, very good. Okay, excellent. Bravo everybody, very good. Okay, so from, from those ideas, which, which one do you think would be the most effective? Opinions? I don't understand the question. So we heard four different ideas on how to solve this problem, right? From our classmates, they gave us four different ideas. From those four ideas, which one do you think would be more effective? Do you understand effective? Could be the third. The third one? Which one's the third pra one? Practice the... Uh with another person first okay. to avoid uh, sounds uh, arrogant. Okay. Practicing with another person uh, before, so not to, in order not to sound arrogant. Okay. Okay. And what do you guys think? Do you agree or do you disagree? I, I agree, teacher, because uh, the other person can help you. Um, for if if a word sounds so arrogant, uh, he or she can tell you, oh, you can use other word mm -hmm. uh, instead of this word. And when you you put the in practice, what you practice, uh, what you practicate, <laughs> when you put uh, in practice this activity, mm -hmm. you will do the better activity, and maybe you can you could be you could feel so. So good. Okay. All right. Very good. Thank you, Kevin, for your opinion. 
what about the rest of you? Do you agree with this? Or do you think something different? I agree with Kevin uh, when uh, she uh, try or speak with other, the other person uh, can give a feedback about uh, the way that sounds uh, her instruction or or word about it. Okay, very good. All right, very good. Um, all right, so we all agree with that. That would be the best idea to practice on another person. Yes, I agree. Yeah. Okay. All right. Let's stick to that one then. Okay. So for the first for the first situation, we're going to say that the best idea is if you don't want to sound arrogant, practice uh practice the conversation on another person. Okay, perfect. I'm I'm saying this because in a moment we're going to return back to your same groups. And what you're going to do is you're going to actually role play the solution. Do you understand role play? Yes. Yeah. So you're going to basically you're going to pretend that you are or acting out the situation that we we or the solution that we that we came up with a situ for each situation. Okay, so to keep in mind that we've decided that for the first one, the best idea is to practice on someone else in order not to sound um, arrogant. Okay, so that way you can practice it or uh, the role play with your group. Okay, all right, let's go on to the next one. Teacher. Yes. Yes, Alice. Um, I will... We will practice uh, the paragraph, the paragraph, and uh, number one or number two. So you're you're going to you're going to role play one for each situation. Oh, okay. Okay, and for number one, we have decided as a group, as a class, that we're going to role play practicing the conversation on another person in order not to sound arrogant. Okay. okay? Does that make sense for everybody? Yes. Okay. Yes, teacher. Perfect. All right. Um, great. Let's continue then. Let's go on to this one. I don't know what to do. My boss is demanding too much of me in a rude way. And I'm starting to feel anxious when he shows up to monitor my work. So what I would like to hear what solutions you talked about in your group. Mm -hmm. What's it, what, what, what are some of the, the solutions that you talked about in your group? In my group? Mm -hmm. uh, I say when I, when my boss demands, demands me in a rude way, I will have to talk to the person. Who is the part of the major he doesn't like for me? I talk with my your boss. Okay, so you would talk directly to your boss. 
Yeah. Okay. So. Okay. So, um, you would talk to your boss and ask them what parts of your job they don't like. Yeah. That's okay. Okay. All right. Okay. That's one solution. Second solution. Maybe if he feels anxious with her boss, uh, he could ask for a list of priority of his activities. Can you repeat that, that, that sentence again? If he uh, feel anxious with uh, his boss or for his boss, uh, he could ask for a list of priority of activities uh, that uh, he make. A list of priorities of activities. Yes. For so, so asking the, the, the boss to give him a list of activities? A list of priority? Priorities. Yes. Okay. All right. Okay, good. That's the second solution. Third solution. Good night, teacher. Okay. If you talk to him about your anxiety, he might be showing the rude way to talk to you. He he might what? He might be changed the rude way to talk to you. He might change the okay. He might change um the rude way of talking to you. Okay. Yeah. Sure. Mm -hmm. Very good. Okay. That's third solution. Do we have a fourth one? Ideally, we could have a fourth one. And I, I didn't understand the last sentence. Excuse me. What is? What Mirna said? Mirna, can you repeat, please? Yes. If you talk to him about your anxiety, okay. he, might, he might be changing the rude way to talk to you. Uh, okay. All right. Mm -hmm. All right. Does, is, is that okay, Kevin? Do we understand it? Yes, I, I got it. What is the meaning of the sentence? Okay, perfect. Okay, so that's, that's, that's the third one. And the fourth one? Who wants to give me a fourth idea? Mm, me, teacher. Okay, go when, for it. Okay. When your manager is monitoring your work, you will need to show self-confidence in order to don't feel anxious. In order not to feel anxious. Yes. Okay. Okay, so being confident. Yes. Okay. Confident right. about what you're doing. Be sure what you're doing. Okay. Don't lose your control. Mm -hmm. Okay. Good. <laughs> All right. Thank you. All right. So we have four solutions there from the four which one do you think would be the most effective teacher i i disagree with the idea of talk to manager because and the depend of the culture of the company for example okay. in my company exists some boss some bosses i don't know if i can say bosses yeah bosses and exists some bosses that are they bosses or like or managers, managers. okay managers okay that uh, they are uh, very very demanding and when and if I and if I say something to they to them uh, mm -hmm. to, uh, they tell uh, it's your problem uh, do the activities and it is your problem I am like this 
Uh, for this reason, I am I am I disagree. Excuse me, I disagree with the idea of talk to the manager. I agree with the idea of the Anna, and a list of priority priority of the activities. Okay, so a list of priorities for you would be better to have the list of priorities. Yes. Okay. All right. Thank you. What about the rest of you? Do you agree with that or do you have a different opinion? And it's okay to have a different opinion, no problem. We're here to discuss. There's no right or wrong answer. Uh, teacher. Mm -hmm. Yes, I Carlos. Think, uh, I believe uh, I immediately agree with Kevin. Mm -hmm. uh, I think uh, in this case, the man, uh, he has explained your boss, uh, how do you feel? Okay. But I think uh, the, uh, the boss must not change the attitude. Um. I believe the man uh, he told he out he out uh, talking about um, the boss of he of him of the uh, both the boss are I don't I I don't I don't exp uh, explain you the boss of both. The second boss, maybe. Uh -huh, uh, yes, the, the other level. You have okay. the first boss. <laughs> yeah. Talk with the second boss. Yeah. Uh, Both the, uh -huh. You're okay. So el jefe, el jefe de él. Okay. Okay. You're so How both you of your superior. Yeah, superior mm -hmm. of the boss. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, in my case, uh, I had similar situation uh, uh, I deal this manner uh, okay. the situation changed ah it didn't yes. change yeah it did or it didn't change uh, uh, didn't change it didn't did, change. Did change oh did, did change, change. Uh, it, it was good or bad? Change, change it. Okay, so it was it's good. good. Okay, it's good. Okay, so um, so you agree? You think that this is the best idea? Yes. Mm, yes. Okay. Yeah. Okay. All right. Very good. All right. Any other ideas? So we have to decide on what's the best idea. What's the best choice here? So give me your opinions. Mm -hmm. What do you guys think? There's no right or wrong answers. I just want to have your opinion. Mm -hmm. What do you guys think? What's the best way to, to approach this situation? Should we ask for the boss to give us a list of, of um, a list of um, of activities in in order of priorities? Should we talk to the boss about how we feel? Should we talk to their superior? What What do you think? I 
I think in a list of priority because uh, in this case uh, he can start ready when the boss asks for some activity or for her his job. Can you repeat that idea? Okay, I think uh, for the list of priority because mm -hmm. uh, he can uh, start ready with her activities when his boss asks for it. So, so you think the, the list would be a good idea to have all the the activities ready? Yes, for this reason. Okay. Uh, Okay, uh, help him to start ready when his balls are free. Okay. Okay, very good. Very good. Excellent. Um, okay. So do we all agree then? Then maybe the list of priorities is a good idea? In my case, uh, yes, I agree uh, okay. with Lorena. Also, I think uh, the problem is not about the number of activities. I think the problem is the way the bus uh, use for us something. Yes. Mm -hmm. uh, maybe see. Maybe is the bus uh, make uh, at, uh, a list of activities. Uh, always, if, if the boss don't change the the way to ask uh, something his employees, the problem is is the same. The problem will be the same. Uh, I don't know if <laughs> I if you understand me. Okay, I More think so. I think so. Yeah. Okay. So, so I guess then in in general, you all agree that. The list of priorities is probably the best way to go about it, right? Mm. No? Depends, but no, 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 I agree. I you think don't agree. No, yes. I, mm. I, for me, the problem is the way the bus used to ask something. Okay, yeah, I, I get that part, but then what's the solution? Because that, I mean, we understand that that's the problem, but what solution can we give? It's, it's some difficult, uh, the solution to share. Because, I know. <laughs> because in, 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 a, in a company, uh, it's difficult employee uh, say his boss don't ask me the way this way <clears throat> it's, it's so difficult uh, the, uh, but I, I know uh, we have to try uh, speak uh, with the boss and, and to and I get a good communication a difficult teacher <laughs> So, okay, so so the so what would you do? The question is, what would you do to solve the situation? Because we we understand what the problem is, but right now we we don't want to concentrate on the problem. We want to concentrate on solutions. So change do you change agree? the change the job. <laughs> looking for, looking oh, for no. other, other company <laughs> because the because the, the, the boss never changed he the true teacher oh, teacher well, maybe can, mm -hmm. could yes. be uh mezcla mix mix a mix uh, could be a mix of of the pri priority of the the list of priority of the activities Mm -hmm. And improve the communication with your boss. Maybe it can be could be a uh, mix. The solution, the solution could okay. be. Okay, but how are you going to improve? 
the 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 communication well i i i have a a, a boss that uh, when when she because she's a girl is a girl uh, when she uh, pide or ask, ask ask for something is in a rude way but when you can uh, answer with we when you give her a good answer she mm, down her her voice her her expression Low, lower her lower her, her tone of voice excuse me lower the tone of voice the tone uh, the I don't tone know the lower ah, yes, the yes. tone of voice yes and but because you you was uh, prepared for this uh, a scenario okay okay so your solution then would be it's a mix teacher <laughs> Yeah, the best solution is a mix because you have to talk with the boss that that make an, a list for the 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 tax or the priority that do do you have to to do at work, mm -hmm. but you have to to improve the communication with him. You have to talk with with him other way. Okay, yeah. so so in other words, it's a so, mix. <laughs> so what but, your 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 suggestion is talk to your boss about um they know shame the boss not shame the the the, exactly. the mind yeah because he's the mind in the mind in my is 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 his role the 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 boss but you have to talk with him and try to uh explain that it make a list the priority that you have to do in during the week or maybe uh, during the month or yeah, but you have to talk with him, with with him, and try to improve the communication. Also, I think it's my opinion. Yes, I I agree with me. <laughs> I don't know. It's a mix that. Okay, so so in other words, so talk to your boss. The how you're feeling, and so that they could improve their communi the communication, and ask them to make a list. Yes, or make a list of priority that you do you have to to do or, uh, during the week or uh, as according a, a plan that you have in your job. Okay. All right. Very good. <clears throat> all right. So, do we all agree that that's the best solution? If not, that's Osman. Say, try to look at new job. <laughs> oh, it's yeah. And link by link and 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 link their communication style and ask them to make a list. Okay, perfect. That's so that's the 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 way we're gonna go about that. Okay, let's go on to the next situation. I'm a new manager at a shoe manufacturing company. One of my employees gets aggressive whenever I point that he should follow safety procedures. Okay, so how what is your your solutions? First solution. I have one. <laughs> okay, perfect. Go for it, Mita. And my group discuss about if you let him know that he should follow safety procedure because he's the way to prevent an accident, he will be understand and change the attitude. Okay. Okay, good. That's one situation, uh, one solution. Second solution. Uh, 
Uh, can you repeat, Mirna? Excuse me. Yes. Um, if you let him know that he should follow the safety procedures because he's the way to prevent accident, he will be understand and shape the attitude. Okay. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Okay, you're welcome. Okay, so we understand that solution. Yeah. Okay, second, second solution. Maybe he um um employees get aggressive. Uh, he could explain the accident that he could suffer. Okay, so like talk about the consequences. Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. A second solution. Third solution. Maybe uh, after the talk to the employee, if the employee is not changing the attitude, uh, because uh, your attitude provoke an accident, because he go he goes. And the therap therapy and the handle the ang anger. Maybe so anger management. Anger anger. Anger management is called. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> anger manager. No, yeah. anger management. Ah, anger management. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Mm hmm. Yeah. Okay, good. Anything else? Any other solution? Oh, so that's three. Fourth if solution. The employee, if the employee gets aggressive whenever you point that he should follow safety procedures, uh, you, uh -huh. you would dismiss of your company. It's legal because it's just fire uh, him. He, doesn't doesn't uh, not haciendo caso. Okay. Um, okay. So fire. That's the fourth one. Okay. All right. Thank you. Thank you. These are all they're all solutions, right? So okay. From those four solutions, which one do you think would be the most effective? I think fire the employee who is not following the politics of security or security politics. Okay, fire them. All right. Do you agree? Or do you have another solution? Mm. That, which no, I, I don't think so. And uh, it's so cruel. Just for one mistake could be the people and fire. So I think the, the whole people uh, has the opportunity to to improve the her is angry or any problem that they could be have. So, but like a boss or or manager or manager or CEO or whatever uh, position you have in the company. Uh, is the responsibility to to improve the team so when they have a, or make some mistake uh, we can make maybe a disciplinary process so the first one is maybe one of one and I meet with a with the person and talk about the problem and try to resolve it just in one minute. So if the problem persists, 
we can sign a compromise for for that reason if the same if if, if the same reason so it is is in that time is the second opportunity that you have the first one is the meeting the second one is the sign the compromise so the third one is fight it okay but you you get a chance a change to to try to improve the the way that they do the, the things but that is my my point of view okay so so your suggestion is to go by parts right so yes yes war first like give a warning mm -hmm. just stopping then, him okay second uh to compromise sign, you, you sign some document sign a um an agreement I that agreement. you that you that, that that the employee is willing to to yes. um if he, to if follow the same thing. Uh -huh. okay and then at the end fire them if they don't exactly okay do you guys what do you guys think about that idea Yes, I agree with Carlos because in department, in safety department, you have to to people, some people, and I, I think that they have resist to shame or, or or they resist to follow the instruction and pressure, and you have to 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 do a step by a step by step because they 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 mind that they. In, in her mind, they they don't. Uh, it's a culture, the safety pursuit, or in her mind, they don't they don't care about the use the 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 the, the safety uh, equipment that that the company require. But in that case, I, I agree with Carlos because the fire is the last. Well, the last opportunity that the the people have, or, mm -hmm. or I think that you have to talk with the employees and try to explain the pressure, and then if they don't care about the pressure, yeah, the is the you have to fire him. The procedure, the procedure, yes. Okay, okay. So you you because, also, uh -huh. sorry, continue. Yes, because they resist at the shame. The people resist at the shame when you try to when you try. To to follow the procedure, the safety procedure in the company. Okay. All right. Okay. So this is my you... opinion. <laughs> okay. No, that's, that's okay. Yeah, that's fine. Um, there's like I said, there's no right or wrong answers. I just want to know your opinions. Okay. Um, so do you agree that that's probably the best way? I agree. Yeah. Okay. So step by step. Step by step. Okay, so tell the employee this is what's going to happen. Blah 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 blah. First step, second step, and then last, you're going to get fired. Okay. All right. So we're going to go with that one. All right. Last one. I work at the sales department. I made some mistakes in a report, and the department missed a good opportunity for investment. The guys from the department are all angry at me. We discuss some um, advices about that. Uh, mm -hmm. We have the first one. In, if you are unsure about the result, you can reprocess the report. You can process the report? And reprocess. Oh, reprocess. Okay. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay. And uh, the other one is like a joke. <laughs> you may, if you may, uh, joke. A I'm joke. Kidding. Joke. A joke. Sorry. Okay. Joke. Uh -huh. It's like a joke. Okay. Uh, if you may, uh, if you may angry the other department, send them a cup of coffee as apologize. Oh, okay. You're gonna buy everybody a cup of coffee. Ah, uh, yes. From Starbucks. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I told uh, to Carlos that is no that that is an solution. Uh, on the in the company is it no funciona así it does it, yes it's just a, just a joke yeah yeah okay all right 
Okay, so reprocess the report or and and send them some coffee. <laughs> okay. A mix of them, okay? A mix of them. <laughs> okay. All right. Second solution. Second idea. There are many, so you can. There's no right or wrong answer. We're just brainstorming here. You understand the word brainstorm? Mm -hmm. Yeah. I think they call it also Juvia de Ideas. Mm -hmm. It's difficult in that situation, teacher, because it's a mistake. Mm -hmm. and, and some people. <laughs> but we all make mistakes. Your mistake. Yeah. So, yeah. so, yeah, so we mean, are human. Yeah. Right. So this is a very, very common situation. Like mm -hmm. it's not, it's it, everybody could be in one of this situation. I mean, this is so common. We all make mistakes. At some point, our coworkers are going to be a bit maybe upset with us. So what do we do? There has to be a solution. We can't just ignore yeah, it. Yeah, maybe if you let them know that you recognize a mistake in the report and that you are very sorry, they will be forgive you, but it, the mistake is done. <laughs> right, no, I, I mean, mean. <laughs> yeah, you can't, you can't change the past, but we can change the present and the future. And that's what, mm -hmm. what we're trying to, uh, obviously it's impossible, like with all of these situations here, we're not talking about exactly. what could have been done in the past. We're talking about, um, remember, first conditional, is a conditional that has a result in the present and the future, and the future. And the future. Uh, uh, yeah but not mm -hmm. in the past obviously we can't change the past so what do you guys think so if if she oh, sorry if if the other sentence is if, if you have some distraction you should be try to be more focused on the report. If you have some distractions, try to be more focused on the report. Mm -hmm. Okay. But that would be something for another report for the future. Yes, yes, yes. But in, in this in this case, I think it is it's a serious problem because the company lost money. Because they, they 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 lost a opportunity to for investment, so in that case the company lo lose money. In, when the company lose money, in, I don't know how to say. Um, las cabezas ruedan. I don't know how to say that <laughs> because it, it's money, <laughs> and it's a difficult to make some advice about that because it's money. <laughs> in that situation, apply the, the fire. <laughs> yes, in that case, yeah, I think the case. fire is the only solution. Yeah, it's the only solution. <laughs> to fire, to be fired? But yeah, remember, like, remember, okay, yeah. so the, the situation is in the first person though. It says here, I work at this sales department. So you're not gonna fire yourself. You're not gonna say, "Oh, I'm gone, everybody. I, I'm gonna, I'm, I fire myself." So there has to okay. be a solution of what you can do. This is in the first. You can person. get some compromise, teacher. You can get a compromise uh, with your team, and you can tell the them, "Excuse me, I did a mistake, and but uh, since now." I'm going to do a better job and I'm going to take more concentration and I get right now a compromise with you. 
and I improve my reports. Okay, when you when you say compromise, you're talking about a commitment, right? Co yes. Commitment, right? Com yeah. So Comment you're you're because I, I'm I'm guessing you're you're thinking about like in Spanish we say un compromiso. Yes. Yeah. yeah. So that would be a commitment. Commitment. Yeah, a commit you you commit to something. Commit. Okay. Yeah. Commitment. Okay. We it's my idea. Yeah, okay. All right. Good. Okay, so and Second other position. solution will be mm -hmm. uh, maybe try to find what what was the, the problem with the report. So maybe fix it uh, and that will that won't happen again. Okay, so to also um commit yourself to not committing the same mistake. Exactly. Maybe the report has an, an some formula, formula, uh, bad formula. So if she find the the problem and fits it, mm -hmm. and she use the same in the same report again in the future, that problem it doesn't appear again because you fix the problem, you fix the formula. Okay, so so that would be a third solution to. Yes, I think find yes, a solution so to find, find the problem, a the report. find the report um uh, sorry find the 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 problem in the report and find a way of not of of not making the same mistake in the future mm -hmm. yes okay sure all right that's the third situation third solution Fourth solution. Mm -hmm. I'm open to hear the fourth idea. Remember, we're, we're concentrating on solutions, not the problem. So there has to be some solution here. Just put yourself in her shoes. If you're if you had made a mistake at, at work, not necessarily on, on a report, you can make mistakes in many different ways. So imagine if you made a mistake at, at your job and people were mad at you, what would you do personally? And, and, and this is actually a very good idea to discuss this because this happens so frequently to everybody. We make mistakes at our jobs and we could be in this situation. So what would you do? What's the solution? Uh, another one could be, another one could be, okay, if the other department find the problem, just may I meet, I meet with, with her and show her what was the problem in the report so in that case she don't have to to find the, the to try to resolve the problem because the other department has the solution so make a, a meet and and share the the solution okay that, that that's good the, the only thing is that there she doesn't really have very much control over it right mm. because because she can't tell the other department, oh, you look at my report. Um, so here we're, we're addressing what she can do. So what's what's in her power to do it? Like, for example, here in this situation, we decided that um, she can talk to her, her um, um, to another person to practice, right? So this is something that's, in her control, she can practice the conversation with another person. In this one, we decided that he, that he can talk to um, his boss to give him um, to to speak to him in a different way to better the communication and to give him a list. In this one, we decided that we can talk uh, that he could talk to the employee and give him 
a, a list of situations of, okay, so this is going to happen first, the second, mm -hmm. third, right? Mm -hmm. So these are things that are in the person's control to do. So we're also mm -hmm. discussing here on what she can do. What's what Maybe is she control of? Uh, as she worked in the sales department, the sales department is not only one person. It is a lot of people there. So she can ask for help to the coworkers and and try to make another solution in the in the in that mistake. Mm, okay, so asking for help from mm -hmm. the others co-workers yes okay because they are a team they are in the in the same sales department so they know the the same thing so maybe the other co-workers uh, they can see uh maybe some mistake in the report and and get solution for that okay so so the fourth solution is to ask your your co-workers for help Okay, yeah. to find out what's the what was the mistake. Okay, all right. So from those four, from those four um, ideas, which one do you think would be the best solution? A means of the solutions. <laughs> The yeah, what, what does that mean? <laughs> the last I one? The last one, yes. To yeah. ask ask your co-workers for help? Yes, it sounds so good. In, Why? In, in some scenario, scenarios. Scenarios? Uh, scenarios. Uh, some co-workers can detect uh, a mistakes because they are looking to other other point. You are focused in in some report and the external person or external co-worker uh, see mm -hmm. other thing mm -hmm. other thing and can help you with some some idea or or like this okay okay very good very good okay i and you know what what i like also about that idea is the fact that it shows your other co your your coworkers that you recognize uh your mistake and that you are willing uh like you're humble enough to to um to admit your mistake and to get help right so so that because when somebody is humble enough to do that that usually makes someone less mad you know it 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 makes the person feel like oh, okay if the person is is sincerely sorry they made a mistake and it gives them the opportunity of, of forgiving and letting that pass, right? So that, I agree, that's that's a pretty good idea. Okay, so tomorrow we're going to put these things into practice. We're gonna do the role plays, okay? We've decided on a solution for each one and then we're gonna be doing a role play, okay? But that will be for tomorrow. So right now what I'm gonna do is I'm going to be taking the attendance. So please um, listen for your name. Theater again. Okay, there we go. Ana Lorena Lobato Orellana. Present teacher. Thank you. Carlos Alberto Dominguez uh, Martinez. Carlos Alberto Domingos Martinez. Uh, Carlos Ernesto Hernández. Present. 
Thank you. Um, Carlos Mauricio Men Menjiver Caballero. Present. Present. Eh, Edwin Antonio Quintero Sumaña. Edwin Antonio. Emerson Ulises Monroe Calix. Present. Thank you. Uh, Ulises Torres Torres. Present. Iliana Rebeca Carpio. Iliana Rebeca Carpio. Jorge Antonio Sánchez Quiñones. Present teacher. José Bernardo, Bernardo Ro, López Montes. José Bernardo. José Carlos Argueta Romero. Present. José Salvador Bernal Quintanilla. Hmm. Present. Osman Atilio Serrano. Present teacher. Juan Carlos Herrera Cordelgado. Present miss. Eh, Kevin Alfredo Lucero Menéndez. Present. Mauricio Antonio Velázquez. Present teacher. Mayra Cecilia Peña. Mayra Cecilia Peña. Nelson Alberto Peraza. Present teacher. Osman Enrique Hernández. Present teacher. Rafael Alexander Serna. Rafael Alexander. Ricardo Ernesto Pérez Acosta. Present teacher. Thank you. Eh, Sandra uh, Abigail Bonilla Cano. Sigfrido Ernesto Gómez. Present. Wendy Maricela Ramírez Guevara. Present teacher. Mina Elizabeth Alvarenga Rivas. Present. Irma Evelyn Rodríguez Torres. Irma Evelyn. Amanda Leonela Zamora Miranda. Present teacher. Okay. Thank you. All right. So that will be all for today. Um, Jorge Antonio, if um, is Jorge Antonio here? No. Okay. Well, I guess he's not here. That he would. Um, that's it's his turn today. If anybody wants to stay um, to ask any questions about the platform or anything at all, I'm here available. If not, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Okay. See you guys. Bye. Bye-bye. Good night. Good night. Good night. Bye. Good night.